everybody, I'm to Blackfish I'm here with Gunjira. Our last video, um, I didn't capture. So you know, uh, I'm a noob. Gunjira failed to capture it because he's a noob with OBS. So OBS uh, is good recording software, though. Yes, uh, he just know how to use it properly quite yet. Um, but yeah, um, we're gonna be doing some more maps. So anyone watch anyone SD who wants maps. to see our last map, it was. Boss as hell. Uh, we were both elemental characters. We did an unidentified rare. It was elemental reflect. It was hell on earth and horrible. Um, yeah, I, I so died. Anyone I, who's watching my I viewpoint of this of video, the portals. All the portals. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all the portals actually, except for one. <laughs> Anybody watching my video should check out that other video on uh, on Blackfish's channel, uh, which. Um, which will be linked if I'm smart at all, and also is the only what's the YouTube term? Oh, I should be putting uh, the map in and uh, be starting. My to channel's do stuff. featured on yours. So. Featured, that's it. Yes, our channels are featured on each other's channel pages. Yes. To the springs. We are erstwhile adventurers. That's our backstory, basically. Yes. We are also erstwhile companions. It's a pretty sweet deal. We pal about. We do adventures. Here's a strong box which we've talked about, so we don't really need to run over the. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm no longer highlighting. Uh, since this is like crazy. Since so this is relatively be high level. Play and not oh, that's be, true. Have a view obstructed by tons of items on the ground. Yeah. Uh, which means that I'll probably forget to pick up items. So well, I'm whatever. still I'm still ruining the, the view of, by having uh, items drop recording, on. Recording. It's probably best that I not always have everything on highlight. Because then you can actually see me play and not just have a bunch of words on the screen. I should do that right now, and then people watching my thing can see what you're talking about. It doesn't really make sense. So we might want to fall back in a second. No, for sure. Uh, basically what it means is that the items that drop on the ground, uh, they're Can always be seen highlighted or not seen, as a... Right? Yeah, it's... They're either always highlighted or they're not, and you have to Hit find a them. And, Hit a key, right? Yeah, if, if I press Alt, it highlights them. And yeah. You can have it always highlighted or not. I have basically. it always highlighted because I can't touch type. I can't find the Alt key, so I just... Oh, yeah. for sure. <laughs> That's part of my character's lore. Um, so, options, and it's under what? UI, right? Uh, key pickup? Key pickup. Is that items? No, no, not key pickup. Key view. Key. You're being mobbed on. Who gives a shit? Protect you! I don't need protection, I've got Tempest Shield and a pretty decent it's, block uh, chance. It's in UI if you're looking where to turn it off. Yeah, I'll always highlight. There it is. Save. Okay. Okay, and then I need to hit. Oh, I don't know what I need to hit to see. I hit D to see things. Alt. Oh, okay. It's, you have to and D is what I hit to pick up things, which is nice. It's two in one. I really like D just because it's it's you don't you don't use D for anything, and it's right yeah, near yeah. Q W E R T, which you see here on the bottom right. It shows you what. Uh, like here, these should be the three mouse buttons, but my middle mouse button's not working, so I have to use the zero key on the uh, right number pad to throw up a portal. Um, it would really suck if I had like an active skill there. As it is, I'm pretty lucky. I don't have too many skills. I never use this one, and I'm, I can sit with auras on my T, which like you could switch this out for, uh, you know, switch out auras, switch out. To a uh, a different active skill if you need to, but still be running the auras. Um, so it's nice that you can be running a lot of auras and have a lot of active abilities. In the last item, I was talking about kind of sometimes the importance of having detonate dead or raise zombie, just as a utility to fuck with necromancers. Um, but we don't have to deal with that in this map, yeah. hopefully. Oh yeah, and in the last in the last uh, map, I also pointed out. Is One the of the more dangerous map, enemies like, are the uh, straight and not like. Uh, I don't know. That's what, oh, there's gonna be an immortal thing somewhere. Mm. Might be a totem. Oh yeah, I see some immortal stuff. Oh no, it's a guy. Yeah. Run right up to him. I can lightning warp away if I need to, but 
So you want to have movement utility skills, and the best way to do that is if I you're a magic user. <laughs> if you're a magic user, you use lightning warp with reduced duration and faster casting. I may need to turn down my game sounds a bit. And if you yeah. are a physical attacker or a dexterity, I guess a dexterity attacker, even though it's a strength gem, um, you use leap slam with faster attacks. Yeah, yeah. And reduced duration, possibly, or I think just faster uh, attacks. No, uh, just faster attacks. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's just faster attacks. Volume way down. Let's turn reduced sound effects volume down way more. Little. Let's just uh, make this reduced boring. duration uh, uh, reduces the uh, the actual cast time, like like. If you see You'd have me, to like, look at the support. A... Wait, actually, one second. The thing to do is you look at the gem, see whether it says um, faster, reduced duration. Where is it? Support duration. Yeah. So uh, that's confusing because I don't know what. That's the wind up of your skill because like before I like shoot a bow, there's me drawing it, and that's part of the wind up to. So, so you could every do. Every skill has a wind up. Okay, so you could do like, like faster attacks and reduced duration, and, I think and like I the think wind up for heavy strike or something. Uh, affects that. Uh, small wind-up period at the beginning of the skill. Yeah, because he like, he Heavy Strike is kind of your yeah, go-to heavy-hitting heavy single attack, moment. yeah. And, like, neither of us have a he has a Heavy Strike character out right now. Do I have my uh, Spectral Throw character? Uh, did you? I don't know if you respect it. I, I want to do... I should respect it and uh, just maybe do a single-player walkthrough of why I like to have a Marauder as a Spectral Throw character. For sure. Which it basically comes down to... Um, Marauders can spec purely into into weapon damage. They don't have to. They don't have to at any point choose between melee projectile and melee. Projectile. Yeah. Yeah. Which means that you can use spectral throw, which is the one projectile attack that uses uh, that uses melee weapons. Melee weapons. Yeah. Um, and it's balls for single target damage. So you're using a me you're using a melee. This is kind of a big oversight of the game. I feel. Um, you're using a melee weapon to use spectral throw. Um, and that's great area of effect, but they make it very hard to to get damage that isn't specifically projectile or melee, and uh, it's just like it's about min maxing kind of in my mind. I I like yeah. to agonize over builds and how efficient they are. Um, but it's just lame if you end up getting projectile weakness. That projectile weakness is lost on your single target melee, or if you get projectile. Uh, bonuses that is lost on your single target melee attack and if you get melee bonuses it's lost on your um your AOE well, if you range get attack iron grip then it, uh, it negates that but i mean as no but not no but iron grip doesn't it applies oh, yeah, strength it's, damage it's not strength, melee yeah, damage strength, yeah 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 so, true yeah. that this is for anyone but who doesn't I mean, know anything about path we're talking about like skill tree stuff which i'm going to hit p to show the skill tree which is huge and confusing as hell, but you kind of, um, I mean, if you're if you're starting fresh, like if you're starting a level one character, you know, it really it does kind of put you down certain paths in the skill yeah, tree. Yeah. Um, it's pretty easy to pick up and internalize, and after a while, yeah. it really clicks, and it just becomes super fun. Yeah, there's definitely um, a pretty big learning curve when yeah. starting Path of but Exile. You if if you've played Final Fantasy VII with the Materia. Um, the materia. I sound like an old person. I need to say the in front of more <laughs> things. Um, but Final Fantasy VII with the materia, and Final Fantasy X with the skill tree where you can make Titus into a mini Oron, I think is kind of what I did, and also made him like the, uh, the, the team buffer. Um, or no, no, like, I feel like the blue guy, Kimori or whoever, he was really, he was kind of at a point in the skill tree where he could really go and and copy anyone else's role. Um, but yeah, also I just didn't like Titus's skill tree. So I was like, oh wait, I'm really close to Oron's skill tree and Oron is the shit. I'll just like grab the cool stuff that Titus has. Um, oh. You walked off without me. Where'd you go? Uh, j off to the right. Off to the right. But yeah, anyone who knows Final Fantasy VII and Final Fantasy X um, will completely see those um, those parallels. skill trees, yeah, those parallels. Oh, we uh, we forgot game, to do the strong box, just to let you know. Did we? Yeah, we we. So it was like at the very beginning of the map. Yeah, yeah. I thought it. We didn't do it. We didn't open it. Okay. This oh, one. Has got all oh yeah, reflects. it's still unidentified. Let me identify it because you can never be too safe. Freezes you when activated. Um, should yeah. I risk it? Because I'm pretty high level. It's not worth it. So use the alteration, reroll, 
Items have an additional socket that could be very good. Probably will suck. Ignites you inactivated. That I can deal with. Um, and yeah, that's pretty lame. Yeah, that was pretty sucky. Uh, Gutting Knife Drops. is kind of worth picking up because it's a 1x3. Um, yeah, I yeah. showed in my. But the other episode I was talking about how to how to farm for currency very quickly. And part of it involves the initial investment or being lucky enough to get a portal gem. Or just... Um, I mean, also, when you're farming things, small amounts of what you farm, you can sell four portal scrolls. Um, but you can just farm the hell out of blues and out of uncommons and rares, blues and golds, gold um, items. Yep. And just fill up your inventory with every blue. Um, no blue is entirely worthless, and before you know it, you have 260 to 300 alteration orbs, and you can sell those for an exalted orb, which is one of the high-value currencies in this game. Yeah. You can get endgame uniques for, for much less than an exalt, so it can be very worth farming up alteration shards, even though it's it's a little tedious at first, but it becomes very kind of rote and streamlined. So this is like Oak's area, but Alira's in it. That's kind of weird. Does Oak call Alira a whore? That could be some uh, like I, hidden, I hidden, so. hidden lore. Oh my God! Mad theories here. Mad theories. This is what this is what people watch. Matthew or maybe and Lawrence's is nerd out. Yeah, he's just half like angry with her. <laughs> Yeah, but, like, for whatever reason, she's staying over at his place. Or something. Oh, for sure. Even though this is a completely different... Is Oak in this type of biome? Yeah, this is Oak's biome. Or yeah. whatever you want to call it. Because, I mean, this is so uh, what if... how... This is, like, the port that he uses. I wonder, like, if there's supposed to be some... Like, if... You could make up cannon shit. Oh, I'm sitting here near Alira, but she doesn't have too many corpses to explode near me. Um... God, there's so many fucking blues. But it would be cool if there was a canonical reason as to why you have these um, these bosses that are basically copies of people that of of figures that exist in the real world, and like why you have these landmarks that are copies of things that exist in the real world. Although this isn't Oak's camp is always the same, and this is different than Oak's camp. It looks like Oak's camp, but it's not. But since this place is supposed to have a history of people always fighting each other and shit, and there always being some form of strife and yada yada blah blah blah, like you can imagine that there was just like a dude who went around building outposts, like along, like just right, had a, had an eye for good now. cliff faces, and was like, "This is where we go and make forts." No, more than twenty monsters. But thank you oh, for interrupting for sure. me from just completely nerding the fuck out. Just, All of YouTube's gonna laugh at me, except that none of YouTube's gonna see this, so none of YouTube will laugh at me. Yeah. It works out. It works out! And... If anyone on YouTube sees this, they'll probably end up complaining that I don't talk enough, and Larry is totally... or Gunjira to is totally dominating the conversation with boring ass shit and just random ass tangents we're starting out but that's people. just kind of how we talk in general no don't say that don't say that we're we're talking all lame and boring because we're not used to youtubing oh haku's here that's why but if you bear with us our natural charm and wit will shine through yes you should completely subscribe <laughs> to our channels and such. Or okay, not. so this guy, Whatever. this guy's kind of a pain in the ass. But since this is a low-level area, I think you can accompany me because it should be. Right. I usually don't like doing hawk missions. I find them to be a pain. I think even from my base, the areas are usually level 68. Oh, if I do it, I might actually level him to level uh, seven or whatever, oh, nice. or five or whatever. I don't know. I want to level him to level eight. Oh, because uh, we have 30 <laughs> seconds, and we start at the. It's, yeah, we're right at it. Okay. So I was talking about desync on yeah I was talking about desync on the other map and uh, 
Haku would suck a lot more if desync was like it used to be. I mean, I'm just running. You can do whatever. Like, I can come back and kill stuff later, but I figure, you know, if there's a time limit. Uh, there's a reason. I mean, I... I died. Yeah. At least you died a lot, so I hope you were at less than 10%. Um, oh, return to master. Well, okay. So, you win some... Oh, you, cool. I got him to level, but whatever. You gain a bit, I died you lose in the process. A bit. But I think you had less than 10% to begin with. Yeah, so yeah. Just, meh, meh, meh. But yeah, that's why Haku is kind of lame. Like, if you, I mean, Matt is much, or Blackfish. Don't stalk him, people. Um. <laughs> no, just don't dox me. I don't care if you stalk me. Just but don't that, dox like, me. What's what's doxing? It sounds like you, uh, look, it sounds you like look it should up, involve uh, drugs. Documents uh, on the person over the internet, and then like send them things or like call the police on them. Oh, okay. For... So is swatting a form of doxing? One yeah, yeah. Means. So you use doxing to get their information to swap them. Oh, okay, okay. Some people, like, they'll do doxing and they'll send people pizzas. Like, which oh, is kind of random. That's sweet. But... Yeah. If anyone wants to dox me pizzas, that's okay. No, no. Well, depending on the pizzas, I'm picky, and also I'm a. Uh, I just fuck. I just. I didn't mean to trigger the daily mission. Have fun selling things to her. God damn it! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, we should probably. We're finished with the map, so we may as well finish the recording. All right. So, uh, so we're gonna say bye or sign off or whatever the hell you're yeah. supposed to do at the end of a video. I'm Blackfish. I'm Thank you for joining us. Uh, like, subscribe, whatever. Uh, or not totally up to you. Uh, We're just starting, so forgive us yeah. our many, many noobish ways. Idiocies. And our idiosyncrasies. <laughs> Their habits. All right, we can't think well, of any. Yeah, we're off. Yeah. Everything is going to end awkward. Like, it's just going to cut off mid-sentence.